Hello writers, this is just going to be a quick video. Take a look at this. This is actually what I stick inside my bag when I go out on trips. This is just something real simple in which I use and often it's inside an 11 millimeter bag. In fact, there's actually a little bit, there's a lot of room inside this 11 millimeter bag that I have, in which I uh, shown inside my previous video. You can see it's been used. So, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so um, this is what I use. Um, it's pretty much self-explanatory. And in case you're wondering what I have it on, I have it on a whiteboard in which I picked up over at Menards. Uh, it's a 2 by uh, 4 sheet a whiteboard. Um, I plan on using these. In fact, I got another one in which I plan on using. Just to make it a little bit more easier for documentation purposes versus actually having to state that it's uh well what exactly i ride with or for the future it's just easier to write it down even though my handwriting's uh, an atrocious <laughs> i hope this helps you out um just to make a quick point these i did not get over at pittsburgh or over at harbor freight these are actually what i picked up over at uh, family dollar if you don't have a family dollar, that's fine. I picked these up for like, uh, I think it was $2.99, something like that. But everything else, pretty much, uh, yeah, everything else uh, came from, I can't really be for sure on this, but this all came from Harbor Freight. This is just something simple which I put together uh, from my massive tool collection that I have. <laughs> As you might be able to tell, well, I'm currently under construction but that's one of my tool chests that's another one of my tool chests then right there inside that ammo bag is one in which i stick inside my vehicle so <laughs> that one's gonna be another video but yes uh this is pretty much what i uh, put inside my own bag um i did release another video in which uh, i'm making it a little bit more simple and inexpensive for you to be able to have but I was being asked uh, in person, it's like, what do I ride with? In fact, I'm going to cheat a little bit and add this to it as well. This I got from a, uh, that, uh, I got a gift for that uh, $5.99 set um, from Harbor Freight. This was included in it. Uh, those sockets, are the thing had ripped over time. But that's why I got something like this. These, oh, yeah, these I actually got as a birthday present, so these did not come from uh, Harbor Freight, but I do happen to have some that did come from Harbor Freight inside that. <laughs> that I'll show you in a little bit for when you do cars and stuff. Uh, this I actually got um, over at Big Lots when they actually had it. Um, as you can tell, this thing is a little bent. It does do its job still, even though it's kind of like in a little S-curve motion but it does do its job and one of the things in which i found very useful was this right here it's a magnetic pickup with a flashlight on there it happens to have a yeah it's a magnetic pickup it extends and this even though i say this on here they change their gifts every year and what they do from menards in fact this year i don't think i got one from menards i'll have to take a look at my wallet but yeah, every year they uh, give out a free gift, um, which you can use. I got this uh, last year. I had signed my wife up, so I got two of these for free. Um, before that, I ended up getting a small little set for small stuff. That includes a, ma um, a magnifying glass. <sighs> I also got a flashlight, just a flashlight, wood handle. All these gifts from our free gifts from Menards. They all got the Menards logo on there. And if you have Menards inside your area, great. If you don't, sorry. <laughs> but, yeah. So I was asked to explain this exactly what I have in my bag. So this is pretty much what I have. But, yeah. Uh, that Pittsburgh. That Crescent Wrench is from Pittsburgh as well. Even though this doesn't say it, it's from Pittsburgh. This is Pittsburgh as well. These Pittsburgh uh, socket wrenches, all their socket wrenches, happen to have a lifetime guarantee. In fact, I had to test that when I had an older version. 
and uh, they replaced it, no questions asked. I said, oh, it's a Pittsburgh? All right, we'll replace it, no problem. It's kind of like what uh, Craftsman used to do. I don't know if they do it anymore. They lost my business years ago. Yeah, it started out with crappy batteries and moved down from there. But, yeah, so this is pretty much what I got inside here. Oh, yeah. Another thing in which I kind of cheat with as well is this is specifically a 5 millimeter Allen head. In which I stick inside here as well. I use it because a lot of times I don't want to use this. And sometimes it flaps around. I mean, I got to tighten it. That's not a bad thing. But this is what I carry inside my bag. And once I pack it all inside the bag, there's plenty of room inside here still in which I can have to stick other things inside there. Say like uh, microfiber if I want, but I don't really stick the microfiber inside there because you, if you're trying to clean off your helmet, you don't want to have that. But this is what I got. Oh yeah, and also a tr trickle charger as well. You'll see a lot of stuff in which I got from Harbor Freight inside here. On the side there. In, inside my garage. My wife just hates it. <laughs> and she actually hates the idea more of us moving close. We move closer to a Harbor Freight. Just a coincidence of where our house was. But yeah. But yep. Yeah, I just hope you liked this short little video. And if you did, uh, go ahead and like. Subscribe. And let's fight that algorithm. <laughs> See you on the next drive. Say See you on the next ride. Stay safe.